Hello friends, welcome to Edupedia World of Education. Today we will learn how to read time in easy and interesting way. A trick to convert time from 12 hours format to 24 hours format is also given at the end of the video. So let's start. In one day we have 24 hours. In one hour, we have 60 minutes. In one minute, we have 60 seconds. A clock has three hands. Shortest hand is our hand. Long and thick hand is minute hand. Long and thin hand is second hand. 12-hour clock system is represented by Latin words AM and PM. AM stands for anti-meridium, that is before noon, which starts from midnight 12 to noon 12. PM stands for post-meridium, that is afternoon which starts from noon 12 to midnight 12. In one hour, minute hand completes one full round. Hour hand moves from one number to the next. Do you want to listen a story? There were four houses. Each house was given a name. Let's go. To first house. First house is on 12. 12 is house of o'clock. You know what? 12 members were there in that family. And the name of the house was o'clock. When minute hand is on 12, we always say o'clock. Minute hand is on 12. Hour hand is on 4. We say 4 o'clock. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 4 PM in 12 hours format. We read as 1600 hours in 24 hours format. Minute hand is on 12. Our hand is on 2. We say 2 o'clock. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 2 AM in 12 hours format. We read as 200 hours in 24 hour format. Minute hand is on 12. Our hand is on 10. We say 10 o'clock. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 10 PM in 12 hour format. We read as 2200 hours in 24 hour format. Minute hand is on 12. Our hand is on 7. We say 7 o'clock. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 7 a.m. in 12 hours format. We read as 700 hours in 24 hours format. 6 is house of half past. You know what? 6 members were there in that family and the name of their house was half past. When minute hand is on 6, we always say half past. When minute hand is on 6 and our hand between 4 and 5, as it passed 4, we say half past 4. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 4.30 PM. In 12 hours format, 
we read as 1630 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 6 and hour hand between 7 and 8, it past 7, so we say half past 7. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 7.30 a.m. in 12 hours format. We read as 730 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 6 and hour hand between 10 and 11, it past 10. So we say half past 10. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 10.30 PM in 12 hours format. We read as 2230 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 6 and hour hand between 1 and 2, it past 1. So we say half past 1. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 1.30 AM in 12 hours format. We read as 130 hour in 24 hours format. 3 is house of water past. You know... Three members were there and the name of the house was Water Past. When minute hand is on three, we always say Water Past. When minute hand is on three and our hand just past eight, it just past eight. So, we say quarter past 8. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 8.15 PM in 12 hours format. We read as 20.15 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 3 and our hand just passed four. It just passed four. So we say water passed four. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it's 4.15 AM in 12 hours format. We read as 415 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 3 and our hand just passed 11. It just passed 11. So we say quarter past 11. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 11.15 PM in 12 hours format. We read as... 2315 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 3 and our hand just passed 1. As it just passed 1, we say quarter past 1. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 115 AM. In 12 hours format, we read as 115 hours in 24 hours format. 9 is house of water 2. There were 9 family members and name of house was given water 2. When minute hand is on 9, we always say Quarter two. When minute hand is on nine and 
our hand is going towards phi as our hand is going towards phi we say quarter to phi it can either be am or pm say for example it is 4:45 pm in 12 hours format we read as 1645 in 24 hours format when minute hand is on 9 and our hand is going towards 3 as our hand is going towards 3 we say quarter to 3 it can either be am or pm say for example it is 2:45 am in 12 hours format we read as 245 hours in 24 hours format when minute hand is on 9 and our hand is going towards 12 as it goes towards 12 we say quarter to 12 it can either be am or pm say for example it is 11:45 pm in 12 hours format we read as 2345 hours in 24 hours format when minute hand is on 9 and our hand is going towards 7 as it's going towards 7 we say quarter to 7 it can either be am or pm say for example it is 6:45 am in 12 hours format we read as 645 hours in 24 hours format basically clock is divided into two parts when minute hand is between 12 to 6 we can say it is in area of past depending on the position of minute hand we say 5 past 10 past quarter past 20 minutes past 25 minutes past and half past when minute hand is between 6 to 12 we can say its area of 2 For example, we say five minutes to ten minutes to quarter to twenty minutes to twenty-five minutes to. When minute hand is on one and our hand just passed seven, we say five minutes past seven. It can either be am or pm say for example it is 7 5 pm in 12 hours format we read as 1905 hours in 24 hours format when minute hand is on 2 and our hand just passed 7 we say 10 minutes past 7 it can either be am or pm say for example it is 7 10 pm in 12 hours format we read as 1910 hours in 24 hours format when minute hand is on 4 hour hand past 7 we say 20 minutes past 7 it can either be am or pm say for example it is 7:20 pm in 12 hours format we read as 1920 hours in 24 hour format when minute hand is on 5 hour hand past 7 we say 25 minutes past 7 it can either be am or pm 
Say for example, it is 7.25 p.m. in 12 hours format. We read as 1925 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 7, our hand is going towards 8. We say 25 minutes to 8. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 7.35 AM in 12 hours format. We read as 735 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 8, our hand is going towards 8. We say 20 minutes to 8. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 7.40 AM in 12 hours format. We read as 740 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 10, our hand is going towards 8. We say 10 minutes to 8. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 7.50 AM in 12 hours format. We read as 750 hours in 24 hours format. When minute hand is on 11, our hand is going towards 8. We say 5 minutes to 8. It can either be AM or PM. Say for example, it is 7.55 AM in 12 hours format. We read as 755 hours in 24 hours format. Now let's learn easy trick to convert 12 hour format to 24 hours format. Time for AM remains same. Let's learn with some examples. 4.15 AM is written in same way. 4 colon 15 H but we read it as 415 hours. 1.30 AM is written in same manner 1 colon 3030 r but we read it as 130 hours 740 am is written in same way 7 colon 40 h but we read it as 740 hours when we convert time for PM, just add 12. Say for example, 4.45 PM plus 12 hours is equal to 16 colon 45 H. We read as 1645 hours. Similarly, 11.15 PM plus 12 hour is equal to 23 colon 15 H. We read as 2315 R. And 720 PM plus 12 R is equal to 19 colon 40 R. We read as 1940 R. For converting PM, remember to add 12 hours to it. Hope you enjoyed learning with me. Like, share and subscribe. Don't forget to press bell icon. Thanks for watching.